In this video, we're going to compare the nervous systems in non-human animals. First, what's the nervous system? Nervous system serves as the body's sensory input and information center, responding to stimuli in the environment, receiving the input, and then acting accordingly. The nervous system is the organism's sole way to respond to any stimulus in its environment. In quite primitive animals, such as the hydra, there is a simple network of neurons or nerve cells that exists between two layers of cells. This nerve net helps these tentacles retract when danger approaches, or it helps them move. In this case, impulses travel in all directions from any one place in the organism's body to any other place in the body. The more complex the organism, the more complex the nervous system, and the greater opportunity for increasingly complex behaviors and communication. For example, in earthworms down here, there is a primitive central nervous system, which like in humans, includes ganglia, a brain, and a ventral nerve cord. Arthropods over here also have ganglia, but are increasingly complex because of their specialized sense organs for sound detection and also for eyesight. Moving on to more complex nervous systems, we can look at the vertebrates. In this case, the horse, this mammal, has the most complex nervous system among these organisms present here. In the more complex nervous system, the organs and nerves are divided into two parts, the central nervous system and the peripheral nervous system. Also, the nerves of the peripheral nervous system consist of different types. Two major types are called sensory and motor neurons.